Hello everyone, so today we're going to be making a book page holder. First, you need to have the sketches ready, the sketch idea and your engineering sketch, the side view and the top view. Once you have that, you want to go into Tinkercad, join now if you don't have an account, sign in if you do, and then just log in. Once you're logged in, go to create a new design. Name it book page holder. And once you have that, change the view to flat view. And then you want to go to cylinder, place it in the center, increase the size to 64, and then get another cylinder, place it there, and increase the size. To 64. Make sure you get a proper one, the one that's filled, and an empty one. And now change the dimension to 27 by 27. And the other cylinder, you want to change that to 23 and 23. Once you have that, select them both, go up here to where it says align, click on the main cylinder, the colored one, click middle, middle, that should line it up and click out of it. And now you want to go to roof, select that, place it there. And then you want to change your angle and rotate it by 90 degrees. So it's like that. And then zoom in. And you need to make sure that it's a buff ground. So go to this cone shape, lift it up until it says zero right here. Then go back to top view. So change the length to 60 and then change the width to 17.5. Go back to front view, then top view. Now you want to line them up. So first select this and group them together and then select these two shapes and go up here to where it says align, select the circle. You want to click on the dot in the middle and then dot down here. Click out and then select the green triangle again. Using your arrow key, press down until the center of the circle is at the midpoint. So this is the center. So slightly, it's slightly too high. So one more down. So now they're all lined up. That's good. Click on the circle, ungroup, and then group them all back together. And you should get something like this. And that's the first part done.